Good evening. My name is John Boyd, founder and president of the National Black Farmers Association, 116,000 members in 46 states. It's an honor to be here tonight and uh, to introduce tonight's honoree. But before I do that, uh, I just have to make a few comments. There's no way I can be in front of this many attorneys. I'll make a couple of comments that's not on this piece of paper here. America is divided by race, discrimination, injustice, and we have to bring this country back together. Love is always hater and stronger than hate. I choose love. Uh, tonight, I want to thank public justice. Uh, when we first sought out attorneys to help black farmers and farmers of color who were discriminated against by the United States Department of Agriculture, after 30 years, we were able to get that in the COVID relief spending bill. And after that, uh, we started to be sued in 12 different courts and 12 different complaints around the country. And I tried about 50 different law firms until I called public justice. Oh, we can do better than that. 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 They chose to do the right thing and represent black farmers, Native American farmers, and other farmers of color. That wasn't in the speech tonight, but I'm very, very proud to introduce one of those farmers of color tonight who are part of that debt relief measure, and you're going to hear about their story. I'm very proud to present June and Angie Provis of Provis Farm with the 2022 Illuminating Injustice Award. The following video highlights their story and widespread and large scale discrimination farmers of color have experienced at the hands of the United States Department of Agriculture for decades.